on April 12th, 2020, just before 1 a.m. Uh, police were called to the 500 block of Mystic Drive in reference to a shooting that had just occurred. Upon arrival, officers located the victim, Mr. Ajon Teasley. Uh, they provided aid. Uh, Guilford County EMS arrived a short time later and also provided aid, but unfortunately, Mr. Teasley was determined to be deceased. He was a father, he had a son, grew up like any other. He was a good person and he had a big heart. He really genuinely cared for people. And a lot of people that loved him, a lot of the teachers at school would just talk about that smile and his personality. The 500 block of Mystic Drive is a condominium slash apartment complex uh, neighborhood. Mr. Teasley lived there uh, with his girlfriend and some of her family. Uh, he was 23 years old at the time that this incident occurred. And by all accounts from the neighbors and the other people who lived in the neighborhood, he was a very nice young man. We have to learn how to, to live with it, first of all. Um, it's hard and of course, everybody have good days and didn't have bad days, but He's always, you know, on our minds or, or topic of conversation. We need it, uh, information. We need people who have information to come forward. Uh, this, although this incident occurred in the very early morning hours, we fully believe that there are individuals that were present uh, who were not involved in the incident who have information. And if they would come forward and share that with us, that would assist us greatly. To anybody that is listening, this is a, a, a undescribable pain. I couldn't even explain what this feels like to lose a child. I think it's the hardest thing in the world to be able to continue to, to live your life uh, without your children. And I, I know I always said that it's hard raising your kids, but I had five and I couldn't imagine my life without any of them. And now to have to live my life without one of them. I don't even know how I'm, I'm, I'm going, but to, to people out here that are listening, love on your kids every day. Don't take anything for granted. Please let us know. Uh, there are ways to do that anonymously. Um, of course, we'd always in, uh, appreciate having a conversation with people, but you can certainly use Crime Stoppers 336-373-1000 or you can uh, approach an officer and let them know that you have information and they'll get it to the right people. I just wish that, you know, if somebody could find it in their heart to come forward, even though it's almost three years later, um, to do so. Because he had a right to live too.